for some people it's just that they want to they just don't like the traditional view and they want this view of God being really nice to everyone and that's their reason for being a universalist and I don't think it's adequate. I, I, I would actually rather someone was more cautious about becoming a universalist than rushing into it. I'd rather someone because I think the benefit of the doubt goes with the mainstream tradition always and if we want to deviate from that even if to revive an earlier part of the tradition um, the, the burden of proof is on us to, sh to show that and, and, and I think the case for universal salvation is it's really good and, and the case for the traditional view is rubbish. So I'm not worried about that but I still think that people shouldn't be quick. To th I think people should take their time to think it through. I'd rather they spent time wrestling with texts to see if they were persuaded and stuff than they just go, yeah alright then, I like that and that bloke says it's Christian so we'll go with that. I, I'm not happy with that, I just I think no. Go to the scriptures and look it look for yourself and uh, you know and look at what the church has taught and does this make sense and you know take your time don't rush so I'd rather people did that and some people do some people don't